All right, so I'll do a little rundown of the rig here. <clears throat> this is a 2009 Toyota Tacoma double cab, long bed, six foot bed. Got a cap on there, Rhino rack. Got the rod vault. The rod vault going, quad. You know, because sometimes you need three or four fly rods going in. That's been great. Um, let's see, you've got a tri-folding memory foam mattress. I think it's a full size. Uh, fits in here just, just right. My sleeping bag, the North 40 Blue Kazoo. 20 degree down pillow yeah that good stuff um, this kind of just folds up when I want to have some extra space like so these are my window shades for at night I can just stick them up up along there with the velcro and then take them off when needed they work pretty well um, <clears throat> this shelf system I made uh, out of just three-quarter inch ply cut to fit uh, works pretty well there's two segments there so in case I only just need to do one side or the other I can so yeah, I made them to length, so they're full six feet. Um, and this was just, made these out of the remainder of the uh, platform itself. So yeah, it's got quarter inch sidewalls, three quarter inch base on the bottom, and then the front, and then I just attached the drawer there. Got a Coleman stove, some plates, some other essentials. Uh, cast iron pan down below. That's about it for my cooking bin. Uh, this is the everything else bin, I suppose. Collapsible bucket, uh, battery pack, jumper. Hammock, um, MSR pocket rocket with some pot and small pan. Got my D all up in D. Fiskers X7 necessities. Sawyer water filter. A couple extra bags. Bear spray. Corona folding saw, this thing works amazing. Lighter. Got a folding show bell. Toilet paper. Butt wipes, need those. <coughs> Daughter and wife's uh, headlamps. Some pretzel tikas, tikinas. Oh yeah, just miscellaneous stuff in here. Paper towels, knives, and so forth. Got a cart back there. And a frisbee in case I want to get crazy. Uh, yeah, that's about it for this side. Kind of just guides itself in there. And let's see, that made me thirsty, so we'll do a little of that. Check out this other side. Same thing, a little smaller of a drawer, but um, fits a 
quite a bit of stuff. I just have like recovery gear in here, rope, um, you know, some clothes, whatnot, clothes box, and yeah. Usually there's quite a bit more stuff in there since I put the wife and kids, so Ryobi air pump. And yeah. Yeah, that's about it. That's my little Kuat pivot in case I want to put a... Sometimes I'll have the bike rack on here or the cargo rack and... Yeah, you can access all the back in there in case you wanted to take something else, like bikes or big cooler or whatnot. And it just clips underneath there. Like so. Works pretty well. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Oh, can't forget. Don't forget this custom made hoe. What you know about that? You know about custom hoes. This is just for accessing things inside the truck bed that I can't reach and don't want to crawl into. Because I'm lazy and getting older. Almost 31. So yeah, I think that's about it. My tent for reservation, chair, axe, fiskers, you know, fire pits, just waiting to be lit upon. Out here, the North Fork of the Clearwater River. And that's it.